Welcome back to my channel guys, it's your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle and styling guys. So today's going to be a quick quick little video. I am going to show you guys my new brooch that I got from Chanel. So brooches are those things that I feel can elevate any outfit. Um, a lot of people think they're like old school or for like older people, older women. Um, I like them. You can wear them on your hat. You can definitely wear them on your scarves. You can wear them on your blazers, your coats, anything. So today's just going to be an unboxing. However, I am going to do a video with how I'm going to wear them for, um, maybe summer and fall. So guys, I'm sitting by the window and it's like a bird over there. <laughs> so I went to Miami district for my birthday uh, with my sister and you know we were just going we wanted to go to the DR um, cafe which you guys will see probably already have seen that vlog <laughs> um, and I wanted to just purchase some things I tried on the Dior sling bags but you guys know I got some big old feet and it was a no-go for me. So that's the other thing about being tall. That's why I said like, and when it comes to trends and stuff, it's not something that we could always jump on um, because things are just larger on us, our hands, our feet, <laughs> all that good stuff. Um, but I don't get upset because there's still a way to be stylish. So of course, you got the little flower. Um, I'm not even gonna go through the motions. The um, and I will say this, when I got there, it was, it wasn't crowded or anything like that. Um, the essay that I had, she was really nice. Um, however, when we first got there, it was like everyone was just standing around, right? I wanted to buy some of their perfume that you only can get at the boutique, but I ended up, we had to rush out because we had um, reservation somewhere, but I think I am going to go get it because it smelled really, really, well, one of them smelled really good. Um, receipt, of course. Now, the thing about brooches is that I don't know like how often you can get them online like in like online on Chanel I know fashion file a lot of people resell theirs um, and like all the secondhand um, shops you can get them from for a really good price I was hearing some things about the the ones with the the stones how the stones are falling out so I was a little concerned about that. So it was a toss up between this one and another pearl one. If I can find a picture of the pearl one, I will show you guys. Um, but I'm just gonna open it. It's so cute, look. I don't know if you guys can see it. They just wrap it up so nice. Um, so let me just, how does she do this? Oh, she's fancy, hold on guys. Okay. Actually, why is okay? Oh, she did a little. Oh, they must have went to class to learn how to tie this. Like, <laughs> it's because it's kind of hard. How does she have it? You would think I would just be able to pull the one piece, right? But that's not what's happening because it's kind of like ah, it's kind of like caught on. They definitely went to class to learn how to do this. Well, let me just pull it off this way. Okay, simple box, typical Chanel box. Um, and pat out. Of course, the cup. You guys already know what it looks like. So this one is a little bit larger than the pearl one. The pearl one was nice. They were a champagne go champagne color which was nice. Um, it was smaller, but it was still cute. It was probably, it was cheaper, it was cheaper. <laughs> Maybe $200 cheaper, but guys, my nails are still so jacked up. I can't even do anything because I crack my nail and it's so bad. All right, let me show you guys. Can you guys see that? It's so pretty. So this one is a bit larger. Well, a lot larger than the other one and it's black and white so it has like the leather inside of it um crisscross 
overlapping and it's the champagne but it's so pretty guys and let me tell you why I love it so much first I was like okay the white is gonna be a bit much for me because I have a lot of cream and stuff however that day I did have on a light shirt and the black on it it just made it pop a whole lot it's really pretty yeah it's really pretty and this the price that part, let me take it off the um let's take it off actually I'm gonna show you guys how inside of the box look and the back of the the actual um the back of okay the back of the I'm gonna show you the inside of this and the reason why just in case you end up getting a fake one from somewhere. So I already can tell that there is a cushion inside of this middle piece, right? Which is the bottom piece, there's a cushion there. And then there is a cushion here also. So there's two cushions on the Chanel part and then in the, the bottom part. Then there's a little flap here where the brooch was sitting on. So look at that when you are buying things online. If you buy something from Poshmark or anything like that just make sure you're looking at that and then when it comes to the hook in the back I hope you guys can really see this uh, I don't know if you guys can see it but it it's like an oval shape there so that way you'll know and then the actual let me go this way can you guys see like the length of it it's kind of long and then it has like this oval piece in the middle I guess oval, you can say it's oval. Kind of, um, not really oval. Uh, it's, a, it's a thing. <laughs> so look at things like that. Make sure you're not getting anything that is not authentic. And also, let's see what else. There's a CC on the small part of the hook piece, right at the top part. Um, what else? So I guess if well, I guess they're all probably made different, but this one is really, 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 really nice. So let's hook this back in here. It's a really nice brooch, like really, really nice, guys. Ah, uh, yeah. What do you guys think? I love it. It's kind of big. I don't even know how many inches this is. The other one was was definitely smaller. It was smaller. Yeah, it was definitely smaller. And let's see, which again was a little bit cheaper. Well, it was a, it was a little, it was cheaper. <laughs> um, so if you guys are into brooches, I would definitely recommend these. And this is, let me see. I have the style number, so I can put the style number inside of the description box if you guys like it. Um, but I think it's a good investment. Take a plain outfit, elevate it if you want. Um, I know a lot of girls like their earrings. You can do that also. Accessories are something that I really love and it can make any outfit pop. Being from New York City, I used to buy a lot of my brass jewelry from the African vendors. And the reason why I used to love their stuff is because they last for years, guys. Like years. It's very hard to find brass jewelry now. So... I'll put the um, the style number here in the description box for you description box for you guys and I will put yeah I'll just put that for you guys and remember I got this from Miami district so if you guys are looking to buy a brooch definitely get one if you're in Miami um, if you're in Atlanta we have stores here if you're in New York you guys know um, like I said, I don't know if you can order it online, if it will be easy for you to get one. Because I know most of the time it says contact the store. So, I don't know if you guys are around. Let me put it on. Let's put it on for you guys. Now, I wouldn't put this inside of a satin shirt or anything like that. Right? No satin shirts. Um... Yeah, cute, right? It's super cute. Like a plain outfit with this, guys, you're golden. So, um, yeah, so I wouldn't put this on anything that's delicate. 
I probably am going to take it off of this jacket because it's a light, it's kind of like linen blend. Um, I wouldn't want to tear it, but definitely put it on something that is going to be sturdy. And you can probably get creative and put something be on top of your shirt first and then add it, something like that. I don't know, just get creative, but what do you guys think? Let me know. This jacket is thrifted actually. Um, and it's very vintage, like it's a very old, the, the freaking <laughs> shoulder pads are huge, but it's a vintage jacket. Um, it's funny because vintage jackets to me, they just feel better. Um, one of my friends, she's so into vintage things and the more I see her stuff, I'm like, the quality was just better back then. So, but that's it guys, just a brooch for today. Um, and this was a birthday gift to myself. I didn't get crazy because I do have things to do. I did buy some clothes that I'm gonna show you guys later on. Um, and yeah, so that's it guys. So if you stay to the end of this video, please comment, Coco, we see you. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, go to Coco Styles NY, which is my business page, and Coco Styles NYC, which is my personal page. All things tall girls and the other pages for corporate styling. You guys know I am a stylist and my blog, Coco Styles NYC, and my styling services website, CocoStylesNY.com. So I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.